Hello and welcome to the Indiraki studio. We are live here at the European Utility Week in Barcelona. I am Sofia and I'm joined with Jakob van Zonneveld. He's the CEO of uh, Plug Surfing. How are you, Jakob? Hi, thanks. I'm fine. How are you? I'm really good, thank you. So, uh, Jakob won yesterday the award at the in um, Initiated Hub, sorry, with this uh, project, um, Plug Surfing. Can you please tell us a little bit more about the project? Yeah, sure. Well, we all know that electric cars are going to be the future. I mean, we've seen Tesla and Elon Musk um, paving the way for electric cars. And say in 10 years from now, we will all drive an electric car. Almost all of us. Almost. There's, however, a huge problem on the market which has to be solved today before this is a mass market product, mm -hmm. so a, pe a product for the masses. And it's the electric, charging your electric car isn't easy. For instance, I'm from Berlin, Germany, and I have in my city five different networks for which I need five different contracts to charge my car. Okay. If I drive Germany from north to south, I need 70 of these contracts. And now try planning your holiday in Europe. That's, of course, it's, it's, it's insane. Nobody wants it. So we've provided, we've built one app which, which you can charge at every charging point. We take for you, for the electric car driver, we, we allow you access to a charging station. We take the payment from you and we forward the payment to the charge point owner, who then also makes more money. So it's a win-win situation. It's comparable with many, many of the common modern business models you see online, like Airbnb, Uber. I mean, you bring uh, supply and demand together, but actually without owning even any of the assets. I mean, Uber doesn't own taxis, Airbnb doesn't own hotels, hotels we don't own charging points, but we bring everybody, everybody together. together. This is great. So this is what you're trying to achieve, basically, of to course. bring everyone yeah. together and to make it easy. Yes. So can I ask you, what were the main challenges uh, you had in this bringing everyone together? Yeah, that's a very good question. It's, it's a new market. It's a new is an entire new situ situation because actually it's a revolution, right? Two revolutions even. We're going from energy, we're going from big, large utilities, there are a lot of power, to decentralized uh, energy production with solar panels and winds, but everybody becomes an energy producer. On the other hand, we see that cars, they don't have an engine anymore soon, they don't need a diesel or benzene, they need electricity. So there are two huge revolutions, there's a gonna be a huge wave and we're in the middle of this. The biggest challenge you always have in this in this hard wave is to what's our position? What's your position? The educational role and the learning from each other is, has been one of the largest challenge. But okay. we always stood to a vision that we just make sure that the electric car driver can charge at your charging station. That's it. We don't interfere with any of the other things. We just want to bring this together. Okay. Um, so I guess the fact of presenting uh, your uh, project here at the European Initiative Week is a huge opportunity for startups. Uh, how do you feel? Like, do you, do you think the event is great? Do you think it brings you to what you want? Yeah, I love events like this because um, you meet in a few days many of the important people uh, from the from the industry, the, the decision makers, or the product developers that uh, understand where we want to go. So you can um, interact with these people. You learn a lot yourself, and you can get a lot of business done in these few days, so uh, that's what we appreciate always. About Did you have a lot events. of people standing by your uh, little yeah. booth and asking you a lot of questions, yeah. interest? Especially utility. They Which is great. Yeah, they want to work with us, of course, because they see the opportunity of, of course. getting in touch with electric car drivers, which are on our sides, so to say. So, yeah, it's, it's a brilliant. huge opportunity. And this year also has been a great year for electric mobility. Of we course. hear it everywhere. So it's good that also the utility week <laughs> This is, uh, they get involved, of course. And um, so, uh, what is next for you? Big thing. Yeah, so, um, well, we started, as you might know, in more in Germany, in Northwestern Europe. So, we, for the next year, we want to expand more into the south. So, we have um, closed a few contracts down in France, okay. which we'll uh, announce soon as well. And we're also moving into Spain and Italy. Um, our aim is for the next two years to cover the whole continent, um, have uh, access to every charge point network there is. And when did you start it? Sorry, because we did, I don't know if we mentioned yeah, it. Yeah, no, I didn't mention it. It's 2012. 2012, yeah. okay. So you're running for five years now almost. Yeah. Okay, this is really brilliant. Um, well, congratulations. Thank you. Again, uh, thank you for taking the time uh, of having this interview. Thank you. Uh, and uh, feel free to check all Enjerati um, and European Utility Week interview on our Enjerati YouTube channel. Goodbye.